we're here at Shark Bite Motorsports headquarters. Me and my dad ended up building a 1985 Box Crown Vic. Um, we built it for these things we do. They're called boat races, where we drag a boat around a wet track. The car looks like this, but I'll cut it to a photo of what it looked like when we finished it. And then I'll show you later in this video how it ended up looking like this and how it performed. Also in the video, what I'm gonna show is kind of a step-by-step -step of how we built the car. It's not exactly what we did, but it's just gonna go through a little bit of the process of building one of these cars. You don't need too much money, honestly. You just need a welder and you gotta teach yourself how to weld. But um, yeah, let's uh, cut it to the intro. What's up guys, I'm Jake Humphrey. I'm Thomas Humphrey. And this is Shark Bite Motorsports. Oh, no, it's just doing like a little walk for pulling the front clip. All right, we got the front end off. Gonna get ready to pull this motor out. All right, got the motor out. Where's that turd? It's gonna be replaced with a 460. Getting all the interior stripped out. All right, so change of plans. We were gonna put this 460 into the Vic, but it's too much of a monster. Can't fit that thing in there. So now, just gonna end up going with a 5.7 Chevy non-Vortec, even though it has these Vortec valve covers, but. This is going to be going into the Vic. So you already did some cutting on the cross member to fit the 460, but the 460 did not end up fitting. We're gonna have to do some firewall cutting, but we're not doing that. We have only 11 days and we gotta get there, so. Got a little more progress on it. Radiator supports in, bumper, headers, motor, motor mounts. It's coming along. All right, guys, a little update on the Vic here. We uh, got the motor in, sounds decent. Got some ties up here. Got good thick radiator support. Just gotta run some uh, lines and yeah, coming along all right. Small block Chevy, 5.7, 1990. Um, Chevy 1500 pickup truck. You know, this is just simple, simple, basic stuff. You know, welded motor mounts, zoomies, out of box 650. Stock motor, so it's not gonna be that powerful. Radiator support though. Some, some chunkiness. Tucked away. So electronic fuel pump, electric fuel pump. 
basic door bar. Chain the trunk lid. It's all just simple, basic stuff. You got a welder. It's a cheap budget build. Don't know why I tried to open that. <laughs> but yeah. Got the derby throttle cable. Oh yeah, I also want to point out my dad's attention to detail. He cut these out of aluminum, so it'd give it its stock look still. Took the headlights out and yeah, pretty cool. Bumper on a bumper. Some other stiffening of the framage. And you know, all said and done, this uh, 1985 Box Vic held up pretty good. Um, it helps to have, you know, a quarter inch thick radiator support and a bumper on a bumper, but yeah. So this car was a 11 day build. Now I know some guys would say, oh, I could do better in 11 days and you probably could, but you know, this car went out there, performed like it should have, and uh, put on a good show. Um, and yeah, can't really ask too much more for it. <laughs>